Now to Positively Milwaukee, an effort to address the lack of diversity among lawyers. A recent report shows that 18% of lawyers in the country are people of color, and only 9% of those are women of color. Sarah McGrew shows us how a local firm, though, is trying to change that. On the 40th floor of the U.S. Bank building downtown, Foley and Lardner is preparing the next generation of lawyers in its street law program. We decided to kind of create like this mini law school. They partner with the Boys and Girls Club to teach high school students from diverse backgrounds about law careers. It's really good opportunity to meet those students who are students we might not otherwise meet, and for those students to get to know us and to encourage them to pursue a career in the law. Ultimately, the goal is to increase diversity in legal professions. It's kind of a reason why I'm more pushed towards becoming a lawyer because I know there's not really many people who look like me, and so that's why I'm really excited to have this opportunity with Street Law. Amelia is a senior at Rufus King High School and one of the students in the program this year. What ultimately do you want to pursue within the law? Um, I want to become a lawyer and just to give back to my community. Um, my biggest goal is to give back to youth specifically. Um, just because I've been a part of like inner city public schools, I've just seen how like negative external factors affects like young people and how it affects like their goals and you know their achievements that they're able to you know conquer uh, after high school. Former street law student Brandon Pope recently graduated from UW Whitewater and is back at Foley and Lardner as an assistant. Looking at who's in, who's in these offices. You don't see much diversity, but law school themselves play a role in that too. Um, but it all starts where, how do we get these opportunities to the people that need them most? And how do we nurture them in a way that they can go into different areas of law and different law schools? He hopes to go to law school next year and return to Foley and Lardner as an associate. Reporting in Milwaukee, Sarah McGrew, TMJ4 News.